Hey, it's Kim uh, from Guide to the Good, live at the Fluvarium on Nagels Hill, and I am with Dr. Tom Cooper, who's from across the street. He's a prof with the Faculty of Business Administration, and he is very active in things like social enterprise and the importance of local. Behind the camera today is Natalie Hare. Hey, Natalie, how are you? <laughs> and we're talking, this is an inside scoop, and we are talking about the value of going local. Hopefully, you guys know about our campaign Oops, called Go Low 10. It's a campaign that encourages everybody to increase their local by 10% by what they buy, what they eat, and they experience. And uh, the benefits of going local are great and many. And Dr. Cooper is going to tell us all about them. And actually, he's usually called Tom, but he's pretty smart. Okay, here he is. <laughs> So thanks, Kim. Thanks, Natalie. Um, there's lots and lots and lots of benefits for going local. Uh, predominantly, it's about making sure that we have a good, diverse ecosystem of companies and businesses and not-for-profit organizations providing the services and the products that we just need. Why do we need that diversity? Because that diversity reduces our risk. Because, you know, if you just have one business that provides everything, and they disappear tomorrow because their owner in Alabama or wherever decides, no, we don't want to be in Newfoundland, Labrador, then that takes away the ownership. It takes away the, um, it takes away the, the benefits that we see in our local community. And so ultimately, by having, by promoting local, by consuming local, and by deciding sometimes when price is a factor, and it may be, you know, once again, I, I have an Amazon account. There's stuff I can't get locally. I go through Amazon. But when you do have the choice to go local, then you're, you're really putting your money back into a community and creating a sustainable environment for all of us to thrive and all of us want to go to have multiple choices to go to restaurants to buy clothes to do a whole bunch of things to go to the to, to do all kinds of activities so it's very much about creating that diversity creating that ecosystem and, and ultimately making our society a better place awesome and we have lots of ways to do that i'm just going to unfurl our big uh infographic which is almost as tall as Tom. Okay, so <laughs> here are some ways to go uh, to go low, go low 10. So you can buy and you can buy locally made at locally owned, you can buy locally made at not locally owned, and you can buy, uh, what's the next one? I always get that mixed up. Goods that are not locally made from stores that are locally owned. So that's an important one. Uh, you can avail of local services. You can uh, take in local information and local entertainment. When you're eating, you can eat locally farmed and locally harvested food. You can eat locally made food, so like bread and cheese and those sorts of things. Uh, you can eat breakfast, lunch, supper, and snacks at uh, locally owned uh, restaurants. Oops, and we go to experience. This is one that we're kind of showing right now. We are experiencing local right now because we are in the great magnificent outdoors where everything is cool and makes you feel better, most days. Uh, you can take, uh, participate in local activities like yoga, art, meditation, fitness, churches, community programs. You can take out, take in local entertainment like the Seahawks volleyball, as well as the Growlers and the Edge and all those guys. Uh, for local, oh, local teams, we just talked about that. Also, theater. Oh my God, just so much uh, local theater that's amazing that people can take in. And uh, back to outdoors. And there's all kinds of options to do all of these things at www.guidetothegood.ca. Awesome. Um, do I have to say anything else? We just, I think that's it. Okay. Do you, do you want to say anything I was else? just going to say there's someone who wants to get by, but, if he, has, <laughs> but he has one minute. Take him for a minute. Okay. <laughs> um, buying local and being local, it really makes... It really makes Newfoundland a special place. It makes St. John's here a special place as well. Because we, you, you can go anywhere around the world. And we have this amazing scenery. And we have this great air. And we have these great people. But it's also about what we can do while we're here. Yeah. And so consuming and being part of Golo 10 and, and using local products and local services and local activities really makes this place even more special. Awesome. Thank you. Okay. Thank you for the gentleman for waiting. <laughs>